guys, what am I making? Today we are here on Roblox, and just so you know, I want to say something. Do not make fun of, actually no. Make fun of me all you want in the comments I'm playing Roblox. But I am playing it just for the sake of this one game. Such a well-made game. Not completely done yet, but it's so well-made. Pokemon Brick Bronze. It's absolutely amazing, and as you can see right here, I have played this before. It is such a good game. I absolutely love this game. And you guys will see what I mean when I get into it. But the reason I'm playing this is just because Pokemon Sun and Moon came out recently. And I really want to record that, but I'm not really sure if I'm going to record it. And I'll, But I want to record something Pokemon type. So, yeah. We're going to be doing this. And as I said before, the game is not done yet. It currently goes all the way up to the third gym. Or not the third gym, the fourth gym. There are four gyms. It used to be three when I started playing this, but apparently the game got updated. So, it's, it goes all the way up to four gyms. So that's going to be pretty cool. I don't know how long, how many episodes I'm going to do of this, but we're going to get right into this. Hopefully everything goes smoothly. It's going to take a while to load. Yeah, it's a very, very well made game and it's going to take a pretty dang long time to load. So I'm not really surprised it's taking this long, but you guys were going to see what I mean by it's by it being a very well made game. They have Pokemon animations, they have cutscenes, they have people talking. They have, they have Pokeballs, they have Professors, they have Friends, they have NPC. It's crazy. It's so well made. And we're going to get right into this. I can't remember if there's any, no, there are no, there's no like voice or anything. It's just stuff like this. It's just like this cutscene as you can see right here. I do remember just a bit from this game. I don't remember a whole lot, but, um... It's, it's gonna be amazing. Here we go. And, can't, are you gonna go inside? Yeah, you, you gotta look inside the window. And we are inside, I think. Yeah, here we go. That's me right there. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> oh, wait. I can't believe today has finally come. Today I get my first Pokemon from the Pokemon Professor. I have always dreamed of setting out on my own adventure with Pokemon by my side. There are so many Pokemon in this world. I hope to discover them all one day. Well, I better get going. Oh, I almost forgot. I need to fill out my trainer card. Okay, type your name. Let us be Bacon. Just Bacon. Let's do that. Bacon, did I write that correctly? Yes. Awesome. I'm that much closer to officially becoming a Pokemon trainer. Okay, attention, no tra attention, new trainers. I'm not really a new trainer, but uh, you know what? We'll do this. So as you can see, it's very well made already. Like, there's, it's crazy. Some notes from the developers of Pokemon Brick Bronze. You will only be able to trade and battle with uh, with other players after you receive the first ship match. I know that, but I'm not going to be trading or battling with any other players. Your progress is not saved automatically. You must either manually save it from the me menu or enable auto save from the options menu. Pokemon Brick Bronze is still in development. There will be bugs here and there, but we are always working to fix them. Help us out by sending a message to T Brad M or Lando64000 with details if you find one. If you have any questions about Pokemon Brick Bronze, you can you can post them on the wall of the official group. Thanks for playing. Ah oh, man, I'm ready. And look, like you have a menu, you have a bag. Yeah, it, it's crazy. It's absolutely amazing. Okay, we'll do auto save on auto save. We'll save every two minutes and after completing battles. Is this? It is recommended that you still manually save before leaving the game. Got it. Yes. Okay. Okay. Reduce graphics. Now we'll keep it like that. There should be um music in this game. I don't know where the music is, but there definitely should be music in this game. So let's move. Let's get outside. Maybe now. Oh, wait, is it, did I turn off music or something? Oh, there, there it is, okay. Hey, Bacon, it's me, Jake. Hi, Jake, how you doing? Can't believe we're going to get our first Pokemon today. Today, this is the day we've dreamed of since we were kids. I'm on my way to the lab to get mine right now. Oh, yeah, your parents wanted to see you before you, you went to the lab. I saw them past my house earlier, heading towards the digging site. Hurry and go talk to them. I'll be waiting for you at the lab. Also, just for anybody knowing, I'm allowed to move the camera only when I'm outside. If I'm inside and I'm in a building, I cannot move the camera. It's so well made, but 
Ah, oh, I just love this game. It's so good. Here we go. Well, that'll all take care of it. We have to keep this a secret for everyone's safety. You're right. It's too dangerous for anybody to go down there. I don't think we should tell anybody about this. Maybe we can tell that, tell that new professor. Maybe you're right. Hi, guys. <laughs> oh, Bacon, you startled me. Hey, champ. Today is the day you get your first Pokemon. We are so happy for you, sweetie. Sorry, we didn't make, meet you at home. We just discovered something in the cave last night. As archaeologists, your mother and I are very thorough in our work. That's right, but enough talking. Let's head down to the professor's lab and, and let you pick your very first Pokemon. We'll see you there. And guys... Wait, wait, what the frick? Oh, okay, that's just, that's just chat. I'm not going to be looking at the chat. But, are you guys ready for this? Are you guys ready for what you are about to witness? What you are about to witness is the strength of kids' knowledge. If you understand that reference, you are amazing. But, um, here we go. Let's get right inside. I am, I'm excited. I'm excited. Because, you're going to be looking right here. Look at this. You guys ready for this? This is probably my favorite part of the entire game at this moment. Hello, my, fa my name is Professor Cypress. I'm the new professor in Midistown. I'll bet you're bacon. Your parents were just telling me about you. You must be very excited to, to... Yeah. You must be very excited to be getting your first Pokemon today. There are a few things you must know about Pokemon first. Pokemon are our friends, and we grow alongside them. They grow, and in some cases, evolve and change form as we battle with them. Your Pokemon will grow to love you as you adventure with them. Oh, that's cool. I never knew that before. Yes, and they're... Hold on. <laughs> Okay, we're good. Yes, and there are still many things. Maybe we're not good. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Sorry about that. I think I'm coming down with a cold a little bit. So, I have a little bit of sniffles right now. But, hopefully we can just get right through it. Yes, and there are still many things that we do not know about Pokemon. Bacon, I want you to pick a Pokemon that you would like to accompany you on your adventures. Make a choice from 18 different breeds. You see what it says 18? Usually there's only 3. But look at this. Look at this. Look at this. He has all 18 starter Pokemons from every single game, including X and Y. It's absolutely insane. Obviously, Pokemon Sun and Moon just came out two days ago, so obviously that's not going to be in the game yet. Or maybe it's just never going to be in the game. But anyways, just look at this. This is absolutely insane. First of all, look at the animation. It's absolutely amazing. Yeah, these... I don't know what I want to choose, to be completely honest. Oh, I don't know what... I don't know what I want to do. Ooh. Gen 1 starters are already actually very good. You have uh, Bulbasaur, Charmander, Squirtle. Chikorita might be a good choice. I don't think I'm going to go with Chikorita, though. You have Centiquil, Centiquil Totodile. I like, I like either Centiquil or oh, here. Um, I'll choose one from each generation. I'll pick between those. Uh, they're all pretty good. Special Charmander. Like level 16 gets a like Dragon Pulse. Dragon Rage, not Dragon Pulse. My bad. But, I think I'm going to go to Squirtle for Gen 1. Gen 2 will be Totodile. Gen 3 will be... Torchic. Gen, Gen 4, Chimchar. Or, no. Turtwig. I'll go with Turtwig. Um, Gen 5. Snivy. No. Uh, definitely not Tepic. Uh, either Snivy or Oshawa. I'll go with Oshawa for that one. And Gen 6, I'll go with Froakie. So I got it between Squirtle, Totodile, uh, what, to I said Torchic here, right? Yeah, Torchic, Turtwig, Oshawa, and Froakie. So, four water types, one fire type, and one grass type. Ooh, it's a tough one. I don't think I'm going to go with Totodile. I never really liked Gen 2 that much. Gen 2 wasn't bad. Don't get me wrong. Gen 2 was actually pretty dang good. But I didn't really like the starters too much. Shinequil was pretty good and involved into Type Ocean. But other than that, not really anything too crazy. Same with Gen 3. Gen 4 was all pretty good. Uh, Turtwig there. So I'm not gonna, I am not gonna. don't think I'm going to go with Oshawott. So I have it between Squirtle, Froakie, and Turtwig. I'm going to get rid of Squirtle. I usually go with Gen 1 Pokemon, but I don't know. I think I don't I, I don't want to do Gen 1. I think I want to do Froakie at the same time, though, because I want to go with the latest starters for some reason. I haven't already used Froakie that much. Yeah, we're going with Froakie. We are going with Froakie. Okay, sorry, that, sorry about that. Just uh, just a little bit of a uh, interruption. But we're, we're back. 
So I accidentally tried, I accidentally got rid of one of the dialogue boxes when I tried to go and turn on messages, because that number two was just annoying me, I don't know why. But, yeah, I accidentally missed one of the dialogue boxes, I can't remember, I think he said good choice, but I can't actually remember, it should be on the screen, or well, it should have been in the video, but... The new Pokemon is so cute. That Pokemon definitely has potential in battle. I hope our Pokemon become best friends like we are. Alright, Bacon, many challenges await you. Let me give you the one other gift that will help you along your way. It's a Pokedex. It's like an electronic, an electronic encyclopedia that records the kinds of Pokemon you encounter, and, you encounter and capture. It will also help me in my research for Pokemon. Also, if you like, you can come back at any time and purchase another Pokemon from my assistant, David. I clicked on that way too early. Early, yeah, early, early, sorry. I think I said David. Now, what are you waiting for? Go and explore the world of Pokemon. Yes, Bacon, go ahead and have fun with your Pokemon. We need to stay behind and talk to the professor for a minute. We'll meet up with you later. Okay. And I do remember that. Battle, yeah. Hey, Bacon, wait up. We have, we have Pokemon now. Let's battle. I don't remember what Pokemon he chose to choose. Okay, that's a bit of a glitch right there. So, oh, yeah, he got an Eevee, didn't he? Hey, I forgot he had an Eevee. But just look at this. This is so well made, dude. I love this game so much. Let's use Bubble. Eevee, you tackle. Gosh, Eevee. My goodness. Don't have to be so aggressive about it. Use Growl. Okay. I may have a chance. If it doesn't, if it doesn't kill me here, I think I'm gonna have a chance. Broke's faster. Broke's a pretty, pretty freaking fast Pokemon. Oh, I'm at 1 HP. Don't miss. Yeah, I did it. Okay, I got a critical hit there. Where, where, okay, whatever. Okay, Froggy wins. Just barely. But level 6, I, I don't think I'm going to... Yeah, I didn't think I was going to level up, level up to level 7. Amazing. I received 200 monies. I don't know what the currency in Pokemon is, but we know what, whatever. Nice fight. Here, let me heal your Pokemon. Thank you, Jake. I couldn't remember your name just for a second. Yeah, you know, it's an excellent battle. Your father and I watched you while, you, while we were discussing things with the professor. We are pr very proud of you and taking this step to become a Pokemon trainer. We want you to know that we will be supporting you as you explore Roria. Yeah, I forgot. It's the Roria region. You need to be very careful as you are going to be out on your own for the first time. Don't forget to floss. <laughs> Bacon will, <laughs> will give you something to take with you as a gift to celebrate this momentous occasion. Oh, wait. Oh, I remember this. I remember this. What is this? Rick Bronze obtained. Yeah, I remember. I remember this. I remember what happens to that. I'm not going to give you any spoilers, though. I made it into a necklace just this morning. When you look at it, remember your family who loves you. Don't forget to keep it safe. We're headed back to the house. If you need anything, that's where you can find us. Okay. Can I go? Nope. Well, that was really cool of your parents. Oh, by the way, I have something for you. They're for, they're for catching wild Pokemon. Take five Pokemon. They can put the Pokeballs in your Yeah, okay. It works best if you weaken the Pokemon before throwing a Pokeball at it. Well, I need to gather a few things before I set off on my adventure. You should go start training on Pokemon on Route 1. Pass. Wait, why? What are you doing again? <laughs> Interrupting again. You said I could continue on. Was that just a lie? Okay. <laughs> That's Route 1 in Chesma Town. That'll be a good place for us to meet up. All right, I'll see you later. Okay, bye, Jake. How you doing? Well, I didn't say how you doing when you say like, okay, whatever. Let's go. Let's go. Let's move on. Let's do this. Oh yeah, I forgot you can see other players in the game, but oh yeah, you can zoom in and out. I completely forgot about that as well. What are you? Are you just a guy over there? Pokemon Fest just has to use a Pokemon Research Resort and Facility. Okay, cool. Um, Route One is that way. This way. Okay. Route One is right over here. I forget what you do. Yeah, I'm a hero Pokemon. Yeah, okay. He's just like the, the uh, Pokemon. I don't know. Go look at your adventures out there. If your Pokemon ever need a quick healing, come talk to me. Oh, okay. That's what that was. Um. Hi. What are you looking at, kid? Mind your own business. Just hanging out. Pretty sure that's the team. Team Eclipse. That's it. I remember. I remember. That's that's Team Eclipse. Route one or Route one. I don't know what you want to call it. Okay, that's a trainer battle right there. I'm just gonna see if I can get into. Pokemon battle right here. I don't know. Again, I don't know where the music is. What's we gonna get? First encounter. We got a Zigzagoon. Okay. I'm, I'm not a huge fan of Zigzagoon, so I'm just gonna take it out. Gosh darn it. Zigzagoon used tackle. Okay. Froakie. Bubble again. 
And there we go. So, wild well, 60 goon fainted. I should not level up from this. 13 XP. Yeah, I think so. Okay. Uh, let's, do a, let's just do a trainer battle. I love, I love the music in this game. The bugs are the most interesting Pokemon. Okay, well, that's an opinion, Ralph. I mean... You can think whatever you want to think. I completely disagree with you, but you know what? Whatever. I'll let you do whatever you want to do. This guy has two Pokemon on him. Look, he's Bubble. Ooh, that was pretty good. Okay, let's actually just do a tackle here. A oh, pound. Okay. Opposing Wurmple fainted. Uh, 25 XP. Level 7. Let's go. Another Wurmple. Uh, no, I can't even switch Pokemon. <laughs> I don't have any other Pokemon. Let's pound again. Okay, pound is not really doing too much. Bubble for the victory. And that is that. Wormple fainted. 25 XP again. Okay, maybe... So maybe my bugs aren't the best Pokemon for battling. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You should have realized that when everybody else came along to fight you. There's a random patch of grass here. Oh, we're into a battle, isn't it? Okay. A Bunnelby. I'm not really, again, I'm not really a big fan of Bunnelby. There was a flying type. I forget what it was. Okay, I didn't mean to click run. I meant to click fight. I can't remember what it was called. It was like a fire flying type. I just can't remember what it's called. Let's see. I get Fletchling. Fletchling. That's what it was. I'm, I, I kind of like Fletchling. And it'll be a good Pokemon just to start off having. So, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can capture it. Okay, didn't do that much. So, Fletchling, use Tackle. Pretty sure all it has right now is Tackle. So, Froko, use Pound. Also, I'm gonna end this episode when I get to the uh, first town. I completely forget what it's called. Chensu City or something? I can't remember what it's called, but... Come on, Fletchling. That's two. Frick! Fletchling. Not supposed to do that. You're supposed to get in my balls. Let's see. Come on. One. Two. Three. Fletchling! Stop it! I swear, I'm gonna faint trying to do this. We better freaking catch this, capture this Fletchling. One. Two. Three. Yes! Okay! Took us three Pokeballs, so I can do it, but I freaking did it, so I'll take it. I don't really like giving nicknames to uh, Pokemon. I don't really think, I don't know, I just don't like it. Okay, we'll go back, we'll heal up our Pokemon, and we'll continue on the path of greatness. How you doing, dude? Are my Pokemon healed? I hope they are. Yep, okay, good, it's just an instant. I instantly get into a battle. Yeah, okay, we got another Zigzagoon. I don't know if we have an EXP share, or just an XP share, I could also say. I don't know. But, I don't think we get one in this game. It does kind of suck, but I mean, like... But, you know what? It doesn't really matter. All that matters is just that you pound the crap out of Pokemon. <laughs> With Froakie, because Froakie is going to be my starter. Yeah, okay, here we go. Okay, let's get into this trainer battle right here. I believe there's one more trainer battle until we can actually move on. I probably should go to Fletchling, actually. You guys think you're doing level 4. Oh, yeah, that's what I kind of suspected it to be. Go Pokemon. Let's see if Fletchling can win this. I doubt she can. But we'll see. Use Growl first thing. Okay, so no damage taken yet. I tackle and Growl on me, so use Growl again. Okay. Is this just the, is this the trainer or is just like growl 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 I swear I swear dude if you just growl one more time I'm gonna find out where you live you okay dude you call you uh, you ask this on yourself I wonder if we can do this you tackle how much damage only four use tackle. Yeah, I'm gonna... Let's switch off to Froakie. Not summary! Why is there summary even there? Okay, let's go switch. There we go. Six can use Growl again. Clip bubble. There we go. Okay. 
I don't know if he has any other Pokemon. But, Brokey level 8. Le learn Quick Attack, let's go. Fletcherin should be able to level up from this. Yep, level 4. That was it. Maybe I should catch more Pokemon. Yeah, totally. Here we go. Let's move Fletcherin out into the uh, start of the group. Uh, can I... Just, is it click and hold? Yep, just click and hold. Okay. So, we'll see what's going to happen. Let's see. This is another trainer battle. This is the last trainer battle until we can go over there. I just love Pokemon. They're so cute. Yeah, I know. I have to agree with her on that one. Susie, how you doing? You got a Bunnelby on you. Is that your only Pokemon? I hope so. Crap, she has two Pokemon. Okay, tackle. Tackle. Hey, a whole lot of damage. Let's go! Fletcher's defense is not lowered. I didn't even know that was an ability that Fletcher had. Use tackle. Okay, only did four damage. Fletcher, there you go. GG, Fletcher. Good girl. For anybody wondering why I'm calling it a girl, shows the gender right there, so. Pidgey. Ah, oh, I forgot there was a Pidgey on this route as well. <laughs> If I would have remembered there was a Pidgey, then I definitely would have been able to, I definitely would have captured the Pidgey. Actually, was the Pidgey on this route? I can't actually remember if it was on this route or not. Probably use Quick Attack. Oh, I almost one-shot the Pidgey! Okay, we'll pound. Just to close it out. Or that, why, am I say, why am I saying stuff like, as I say, like, um... I, I'm saying stuff like I say it when I'm in like when I'm doing like Call of Duty stuff for some reason. I don't know, but what we get? Yeah, Pidgey. Okay. Hope I'm hoping that I can catch this one. Cause being honest, if I get Fletcherin and Pidgey, Fletcherin can Fletcherin actually evolves into a Fire type, or maybe Fletcherin is already a Fire type. I can't actually remember, but. If I can get a Pidgey and a Fletcherin, Pidgey will be my flying type, and Fletcherin will be my fire type. Okay, I mean, I'm not gonna complain that I caught it, but why did the Fletcherin take so long to catch when a Pidgey was literally one Pokeball at basically half? Fletcherin's level 5, there we go. Okay. So we got that, let's get this Pokeball. What is it? We got Potion, okay. So let's just put Pidgey at the start. Walk right through. We got another battle on a Bunnelby. Okay. Go Pidgey. I believe Pidgey only has tackle. Yeah, okay. That's what I saw it. Can I risk? Nah. Fletcherin is a normal flying. I believe Fletcherin evolves into a fire type. A fire flying type. I might be wrong about that. Do not quote me on that. But I'm pretty sure Fletcherin evolves into a fire flying type. So, tackle. Okay. Final B is pretty freaking strong though. I have to I have to admit that Final B is a very, very strong Pokemon. I just that it's like not my type of Pokemon. Quick attack and That's that. Okay, Final B fainted. Brokey gained 20 XP. Pidgey gained 20 XP. Pidgey did not level up, like Pidgey was supposed to level up. Okay, let's just go through this. And back again! <laughs> I got here as fast as I could. Something terrible has happened. I need to come. I need you to come back to the town with me. I don't have time to explain. Let's go. Okay. <coughs> Gosh, I, I remember. I remember what is happening. Sad times are here. Bacon, I'm so glad to see you are safe. I'm so sorry to be the one to tell you this, Bacon, but your parents have been abducted from their home in the short time you have been gone. Not much is known yet, but I suspect that they were, they were taken by a group of people known as Team Eclipse. Told you, Team Eclipse. This is why they are enemies, and I remember actually a pretty funny thing that happens to a Team Eclipse grunt, or not a grunt, a, 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 peep, a, a person. A Team Eclipse, Team Eclipse leader sort of thing. It's so funny what happens, but... Also, just so you guys know, I want to say this right now, the Team Eclipse leader is a girl. If I remember correctly, the Team Eclipse leader is a girl. I think. Um, do not quote me on that as well. Okay, you see Team Eclipse is an organization of people who have unique perspective on people and Pokemon. They believe... <coughs> oh, gosh. Okay. They believe that people and Pokemon are not in harmony with one another, and they have interesting ideas for how to solve this problem. They are also dangerous and will not be tripled, tripled with. They seem to be do... They seem to do whatever it takes to accomplish their goals. I do not know what... I do not know... I do not know what they want with your parents, but I suspect it has something to do with their skills as archaeologists. Your parents are familiar with the Pokemon of Legend Unroria. 
Whatever team eclipses after, I'm sure they are go getting very close to achieving it. Now tell me, Bacon, did your parents say anything about their work when you saw them this morning? Oh, so your parents gave you that necklace, or, uh, that's interesting. Anyways, it's not safe for you to hear now. Bacon, I think for the time being, it's best you leave town. At least until we figure out what's happened here. Chesma Town is a good place to start. It's just past Route 1. Be careful now, Bacon, and don't go looking for trouble. The sad times are here. And then the happy music comes right back. It's so weird, but, um, Pokemon, yeah, okay, I need to heal up. What are you? I don't know why, but the water has always scared me. I'm not a very good swimmer. Some people ride in the backs of the Pokemon and, and let them do swim, do the swimming. Yeah, sir. Here, let me hear your Pokemon. Thank you, dude. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh! Bono Bay! There we go. We got a picture, though. Level 2, though. Like nothing too crazy. Let's see. I'm gonna do one tackle with Bacon. See what happens. Oh, wait. Bono Bay has agility at level 4? <laughs> yeah, okay. That's not gonna work out well. Fletchering, they're gonna come out. Come on, Flexion. Why would Bundle Bay use, use Leer? Yeah. Fletchering is immune to your Leer. Tackle. Tackle. And there we go. And tackle again. And tackle again. And that is that. Okay. Pidgey, you better hold up, Pidgey. Pidgey! You gain 46 XP. How much XP do you need to freaking level up to level 3? Pidgeys, dude. Can't, you can't trust them sometimes. Oh, just for anybody who, who wants to know, you cannot jump in this game. It is impossible to jump in this game. I think that's actually pretty cool. So, just go right through. See what we can get. I believe Chesma Town is right here. Yep. Okay. So, we're going to be right here in Chesma Town. Hopefully, the uh, music uh, will come back. Hey, over here. Oh, I remember you. Okay, I'm not going to spoil anything, but I know who this girl is. You're going to get right to it. Okay. You look like a brand new trainer. This must be your first time traveling alone. I see. Your parents were abducted by Team Eclipse. That's terrible. I have some I have some information about Team Eclipse that might be valuable. Follow me to my home where we can discuss it privately. First time in place, I did not trust her. I did not trust her. And just again, I'm not gonna spoil anything. You guys are gonna see in the next episode wh what this girl what this girl is. She's got she's gonna be exposed next episode. See, our parents are taking my team of clips. Gosh, that must be awful. I bet you missed must miss them. Oh, so they gave you that neck necklace before they were taken. Do you mind if I see it? Thanks. This necklace looks old and valuable. Heh, <laughs> thanks. Never mind. Okay, apparently I just expose her hair. Okay, yeah, you see that. Hey, there you are, Bacon. Who was that person who just, just took off running out here? Wait, what? She took the necklace that your parents gave you? That was the last thing your parents gave before they gave you before they disappeared. We have to get go after her and get that back. I saw her running into the woods just outside of town. Quick, follow me and I'll lead you there. See, I, that's why I did not trust her. She looked so shady just waiting at the beginning and start of the town. I, I didn't trust her, but let's save. Save the game. Yep, we shall save. And now I just spit all over my keyboard, so I'm going to get it spit off of it. Okay, we're good. So now I believe I just healed, but Fletcher needs to heal. So that's that. I'm going to be going down that way, and I'm going to get that necklace back. You guys are going to see what that girl is. That She's not completely exposed. I'm not, I'm not going to risk any. I'm not going to tell you guys anything. And also, here's the map at the moment, what it looks like. I think this is maybe... Let me look. Can I... No, I cannot. Okay. Um, I believe, if I'm correct, that I am, I am definitely right here. This is Chesma Town, if, if I'm correct. And you start heading up, you get to here, which I believe leads you to the second gym or something like that. I can't actually completely remember, but, and then, like, this is probably, I think this is gym over here somewhere. But, that is that. So... Pretty crazy stuff, all right? Oh, yeah, the Pokemon. I forgot about this. Uh, Pokemon. Welcome to the Pokemon. May I help you? Uh, let's buy something. What we got? Pokeballs, potions, antidotes, paralyzed heroes. Okay. How much can we buy, actually? I can buy 200,000 just for 275. My goodness, dude. I have, like, 4,000 in this game. 
Okay, well that's gonna be that for episode number one. I really hope you guys enjoyed this series because I really want to record more of this. This is so fun. I just absolutely love this entire game. It's so well made. But anyways, that's gonna be it. <sighs> Look at the Starbucks coffee. Okay, so anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you slap that like button and subscribe for more. I hope to see all you do in the next video. Here we go! Yeah.